welcome back everyone to another tutorial on tableau this series of videos will help you take your skills from beginner to expert level in tableau do not forget to hit the red subscribe button and the bell icon so that you are the first one to know whenever i upload any new video in today's session we will see how to highlight minimum and maximum value in a line chart in tableau let me first show you the demo of what we will be doing today. Here I have a line chart that shows sales done in case of different months starting from January till December. The requirement is that we need to highlight the minimum and the maximum value in this line chart so that by just viewing this chart we can easily figure out the month with the lowest sales and the month with the highest sales so from the legend we can figure out that the green color gives us the month with the highest sales and the red color gives us the month with the lowest sales now let's jump to tableau and see how to highlight minimum and the maximum value in a line chart first we will create a line chart so drag order date to the column shelf from the drop down we will select continuous month now drag sales to the row shelf so here we have a line chart that shows sales done in different months now to highlight the minimum and the maximum value in this line chart like in this dashboard here this is the minimum value and this is the maximum value we will create a new calculated field go back to the sheet click on the drop down click on create calculated field let's name it min max and write down if sum of sales equal to window max sum of sales then we want max else if just copy this line and paste it here so this will be else if sum of sales equal to window min sum of sales then min else other end so when we will check the description of this window max function we will find that window max will return the maximum value within the window so in our case this entire line chart is the window and we are telling tableau to look for the maximum value in this line chart so if sum of sales is equal to the maximum sum of sales then we are calling it max similarly if we will check the description of window main function we will find out that window main function will return the minimum value within the window so we are telling tableau to look for the minimum value in this line chart and if the sum of sales is equal to the minimum sales value then we are calling it min else if both the conditions are not followed then we want to see other so now click on ok now to highlight the minimum and the maximum value in this line chart we will make use of dual axis so press control on the keyboard and drag one more sales field in the row shelf now for the second sales field for the marks type we will select circle now drag the new 
calculated field that we have created to color and to create a dual axis chart click on the drop down and click on dual axis let's synchronize both the axis right click and click on synchronize axis in this line chart we need to highlight only the minimum and the maximum value from here we will remove others right click and click on hide so now you can see that in this line chart this is the maximum value which we are getting at november 2017 and the minimum value is highlighted with orange which we are getting in the month of february in the year 2014 now let's change the colors double click on max and we will select green for max and let's select red for min click on okay click anywhere outside hide the header right click uncheck show header now create a new dashboard let me change the dashboard size write down here 1000 pixel as the width and 500 pixel as the height now drag the line chart that we have created let me update the title and here we can write down how to highlight minimum and maximum value click on okay now from the legend we can easily figure out that the green color corresponds to the maximum value and the red color corresponds to the minimum value so in this way we can make use of window max and window min functions to highlight the minimum and the maximum value in this line chart this was all that i had to cover in this session i have added the link of this workbook in the description below thanks for watching this video i hope this session was helpful see you in the next tutorial